So we just finished the, stitching out this built-in design on the Bernina 570 embroidery machine. And I just want to talk about tension for just a second. One thing that you're looking for is number one, so this design just has like single lines and actually more triple lines. When I first started, I got an okay stitch, but I could kind of see some of my bobbin thread coming up. And so what I did was I reduced the top tension down just a little bit. So there's nothing wrong with my threading or my machine, but just when it was doing those little fine stitches, it just needed a little bit more pull to the back side. Now I had already stitched out most of color one when I discovered that. So one of the things that you could do is just, I haven't taken this out of the hoop yet, is I can just put it in and re-stitch color one at that new tension. So what you're looking at is mostly when you turn it over on the back side, you want to be able to see the color from the top thread on the back. Now if you're seeing mostly white because you have a white bobbin in, that's you're probably seeing some of the white coming up here. Now just because you see a little white thread coming up to the top side, just all you have to remember is that you're going to take your tension to a smaller number. So if it was at three, you're going to come down to like two and a half or two. Bring it down a whole number and that way you really will see the change. On a design with a satin stitch, when you flip it over, you're going to see good portion of the back with the color on the edges and kind of a white center to it is what good tension is all about. Now if you happen to have where all your color is on the back side and you're not having any of the bobbin thread showing, now we have some other issues. Did your machine get cleaned and oiled lately? Are you threaded correctly? There might be something pulling that to the back side. You shouldn't have all the color on the back. So just kind of, you need kind of that happy medium, but we do need no bobbin thread showing on the top. And if you see it, reduce it down. You can reduce it while you're actually stitching. You touch that top corner and you can just minus it while it's stitching until you get a nice finished look. So you know you're gonna get a perfect finished design when you're done. If you want to learn more about tension, make sure you check out our Embroidery Essentials online course. We're going to do uh, one of these designs as a, a applique um, technique for this machine. We're going to do this butterfly actually. And, and I'll show you more with the tension and what it looks like on the back side. But this is a course that when you take it, you're going to learn over 15 different embroidery techniques. We've got shadow work. We've got confetti. We've got tile scenes. We've got cut work. We've got shadow work. Here again, applique, trapunto. It's just a great way to explore your machine. And we have 20 videos that you can preview for free to see if this course is right for you. So make sure you check out the links below this YouTube video in the description, click on them, go watch some of those free videos and see if this course is right for you.